recording. I, Kalel of Krypton, being of sound mind, declare this to be my final dispensation. Superman's last will and testament. There's so little time left now. The end is getting closer and there are still so many things I've yet to achieve. The time traveler Samson told me I'd complete 12 legendary super challenges before my death. I would answer the unanswerable question, overcome the tyrant son Solaris, even create life. Each challenge, of course, brings me closer to my death. And by my reckoning, I have accomplished seven so far. No time to lose. So when I'm gone, when I'm not around anymore to protect them from the mad scientists and the monsters and themselves, can they survive their own self-destructive urges? There was only one way to study a world without Superman. I had to make one. Deep in the tangled briar of gas clusters that forms the barely breathing heart of the sickly infant universe of Quar, I found a promising speck of grit. I applied a nano-optical transfusion of pure solar energy. Earth Q breathed in. There on the hostile shores of infinitesimal oceans, life seized its moment. Stay in the apartment. You have to believe me. I'm on my way. They tore the shite apart looking for this. Sh- then just dropped it when that reporter got in his way. He thought it was some kind of time capsule. But see the date. 2312. A time capsule from the future buried in the past. Lead. Opaque to even my X-ray vision. Uh Uh-oh. Looks like he's coming back for more. Hold on to this. I won't be long. Die, Superman, die! Lois? Don't ask. I am the true man of steel, the American man of tomorrow. Do your worst. He's on some wild electronic goose chase for Luther. It's barely a story, Superman. The guy has Alzheimer's. Oh, no, wait. Don't fly away, Superman. You do realize I ran straight into Mechano Man's warpath because it seemed like the easiest way to get your attention. What does that say about how much we need to talk? Why don't you want to talk? I will, Lois. When I'm done, we'll talk about all of this. Look at you. Don't think I don't know. Leo Quintum told me you were dying of solar radiation overdose. You told her. I'm afraid it just slipped out, Superman. It seemed wrong that you should bear this alone. You can't die. I I know you'll find a way out of this. Promise me you'll find a way. As she spoke, I watched 35 million dead skin cells scattering like confetti. Like promises. Like the dust of dead stars. Our biology is completely incompatible. We could never have children. Never have more than this. There's always a way. That's what you always say. Hey, watch what you're pushing. Cancel the backup, Shelly. We're going to get Oh, God, I'm on my way. Where did you say you wanted to go, buddy? Don't put the phone down. Take it easy. Take it Don't easy. Don't put the phone down. I have to go, Lois. Someone needs me.
<laughs> Your doctor really did get held up, Regan. It's never as bad as it seems. You're so much stronger than you think you are. Trust me. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. It's okay. Everything is going to be all right. Everything is going to be all right. Even with our incredible speed and stamina, we still can't prevent your white blood cells from committing suicide. After all you've done for us, we failed you. All of you did everything you could. Believe me, it felt great. Truth is, I only needed your help long enough to accomplish today's tasks. I didn't think you'd be able to save me. But human diseases would be no match for your knowledge and power, am I right? Microscopic Kandorian super doctors could cure anything. Superman, we didn't expect to see you back so soon. I just dropped by to tell you all I might not be able to make it next week. But don't worry. You'll all be going home long before that. <laughs> I brought some friends. I really think this is it. Third time lucky. This is the one. We're gonna make a million dollars. This is gonna change everything.